This is an interactive webinar, unlike any webinar you've attended before wherein you just listen and fall asleep. I will have to ask you to think. I will ask you to say something. So be, be mindful that if you're washing your dishes while you're doing this, you're gonna miss out because I'm gonna ask you to type stuff. Okay, start na. Seven minutes na yon. So let's begin with an exam, a test, because you guys really miss school, right? So let's begin with the test. Everybody, are you happy with the test? Say yes. Wala kayong choice ang ganun. Go with the test kahit na ayaw nyo. Say yes. We're gonna start with the test. Okay. Good. So here it is. I'm gonna show you some pictures. And in the chat room, wag na allowed. In the chat room, tell tell everyone in the chat room or tell me kung nakagaw to webinar ka. If you like the picture or not. You can use words like love, super like, don't like, stuff like that. So this is the test. Okay? Let me show you some pictures and you just say, I like, I love, I don't like, super like. Uh, kung ano man yung appropriate na gusto mong sabihin. Go, go, go. That's the first, that's the first picture. Come on. That's it, that's it. I'm just gonna look at your super like. That is a car. For some, you already know that's James Bond's car, but you know. So let's check out the next one. For those of you who don't like cars, so what we're doing here is we're good. We're letting you experience the world of Pinterest. This is the world of the social network I'm talking about. The social network that has buyers instead of frienders. Okay. So this is the mindset of this new social network that is is getting more sales for uh, for companies versus Facebook, and it's just new. So here's another one. Okay. It's a quote. Happiness will never come to those who fail to appreciate what they already have. Oh, what a depressing thing! Happiness will never come to those who appreciate who those who fail to appreciate what they already have. Like, super like, don't like. What do you think? Okay, for those of you who, who love to travel in their imagination, okay, this is a place, I think this is Thailand, no? Thailand, no? Where they buy and sell all those things that mga malengke ka. Tama ba? Thailand, no? Na malengke sila dyan, di ba? Tapos dyan si Tomb Raider nag-shoot, di ba? May, may situation na gano'n na nag-shoot siya na mayroong boats. Of, of course, it's not Thailand. Hindi na papansin yung malaking malaking bridge na yon. <laughs> Dapat pag nakita niyo yung bridge sa side, yung kulay puti, alam niyo kung ano yan. That's Venice. Okay. Alam niya, Rina. <laughs> joke lang yun. Oh, ito, hindi to joke. I don't know where it is. This is probably somewhere in um, Death Valley. Where is that? Death Valley, California? Or Turkey? What do you think it is? Here's the question. Do you like it? Don't like it? Whatever. Meh? Pwede kayo sumagot ng meh, M-E-H. Ang isa sabihin ng M-E-H, wala kang pakiya, pangit. Ganyan, ganyan ang buhay eh, sa buong internet, di ba? So, pwedeng M-E-H, meh. Okay, okay, okay. Parang ano, no? Parang grease, sabi na. Yung grasa. Okay. Okay, that is a iPad case, I think, and it looks like a book. An iPad case that looks like a book. Like it? Don't like it? What is your decision regarding this one? You decide. Another one. Di 
talaga pwedeng action movie. Tinik ko yan. <laughs> Either somebody's watching an action movie and, you know, ewan ko kung rinig niya yan, pero I told them to stop it. <laughs> okay. Like, how about this one? Huh? The next one, huh? I'm sure none of you will uh, say I don't like. I'm sure. No? It's a whale sculpture, Christina Cruz. I think. I think it's a whale sculpture. Yes, kanina I was far from the mic. Kasi kanina nanonood ng movie eh. <laughs> oh, ano? Gusto niyan? Ayan niyan? Okay. So, congratulate yourself. You are now in the world of Pinterest, where people just look at pictures all day long and decide if they like or not. If they like it, it's pizza. Ano ba kayo? It's pizza. <laughs> if they like it, they collect the pictures. If they don't like it, they don't collect the pictures and they go to the next picture. Okay? That's the world of Pinterest. So, uh, people actually spend, Americans uh, at least spend uh, 90 minutes a day doing this. Doing this task of collecting pictures for themselves. And a lot of us already know that we love collecting pictures, especially if we like it. So, before you, you go deep into the world of Pinterest, let me just show you that Pinterest is not something that I just invented. The whole world is using Pinterest already. Okay? And, yes, Alan, I can see what you just typed in. Ah, Dennis pala. The whole world is using Pinterest, about 50 million people, I think. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, if you, if you know the answer, but... We are not even popular in, in Pinterest so much because the Philippines is just like 35th user in the world and the United States is 16th user in the world, okay? So, I don't know who's number one. The important thing is our country is in the 35th. We are the number one Facebook user on the planet, okay? But Pinterest, we're the 35th nation to use Pinterest ever. So. This tells you that there are people in the Philippines who are addicted to Pinterest. And that is the word, really. If you're addicted to your Facebook wall, a lot of people have discovered that if you... Here's a question for you. Answer chat room, huh? Answer in the chat room or in the questions. If I showed you beautiful things all day long, will you tell me to stop? No. If I would... would if I showed you beautiful pictures, would it be a good thing for you? All day long. Showed you beautiful things, beautiful videos, beautiful pictures. Would it be a good thing for you? Would it be something welcome for you? Pag sumagot kayo ng no, bahala kayo. Something wrong in the brain. Okay. Showed you beautiful things, beautiful events, beautiful photos, beautiful videos. Are you, is it going to be a, a, something you welcome? So using that kind of psychology, okay, okay, using that kind of psychology, hindi ka addict, hindi ka semi addict Mia sa Lueta. You are an addict sa Pinterest. Actually, Mia, who's in the chat room, said Justin is the first person who tells, who told me about Pinterest. You know, of course, I ignored her. Tas malipala ako, di ba? <laughs> People are paying attention to Pinterest, and you're gonna find out today why that's the case. Okay. So here it is. An example of a company using Pinterest. The name of the company is called Shopify. As in, like, shop. So Shopify is a website just like Amazon. They sell products. Pero actually, uh, Shopify is a store front. Para siyang mall. SM sells directly through the department store. But there's also Bio. There's also Wendy's. There's also different kinds of stores inside uh, SM, right? And Shopify is just like that one. No? It, it sells a lot of other products created by other things. And there are stores inside Shopify. They discovered, no, uh, this, just two months ago, that if people came from Facebook, there are a lot of people coming from Facebook going into Shopify to buy products. Okay? So, marami talagang market. So, next to that, Twitter is sending them people. And then next to that is Pinterest. Remember, Twitter and Facebook, matagal na yan. Pero ang Pinterest is just one year old. I discovered Pinterest August last year, okay? A certain Mia told me about it, okay? Now, let me tell you that even though 26% of the people coming into Shopify are coming from Facebook, Shopify discovered that the people coming from Pinterest are the ones that buy the most, okay? 
uh, the, the person who invented Pinterest is an American dude. Okay. Y- 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 I forgot his name. Just just to, sell, just to uh, tell you, huh? That average order of a Pinterest person is $80 versus $40 from Facebook. There are more people coming into Facebook, okay? But there's only eight, uh, there's uh, $40 ang binibili na nila, okay? Mas maraming binibili ang mga tao galing sa Pinterest. So, question. What does that mean? Using super, super common sense, what does it mean for you if you see a website wherein the people are buying more? What does it mean? Come on. You gotta answer this sa chat room. You gotta answer this sa chat room. What does it mean if Pinterest, all of a sudden, pumupunta pala doon yung mga tao is buying more than people coming from Facebook? What does it mean? Come on, come on. Try to guess because this is my role for you guys. My role is for you to think like a marketer because alam nyo ba na kung, let me just ask you something just to even things out. Number one, kilala nyo ba ako? Okay. Okay. So ako si Jomar Hilario. My, the thing I do all day long is surf the internet and that is the truth. Okay. I sometimes take care of my kids but I surf the internet for fun. So that's my, what I do all day long. How I make money is I I am an online marketer. I market other people's products. I also market my own. I teach people online. I also teach using seminars. Here's the question there. I was not uh, I was not a marketer when I started. I was a computer science graduate. How did I convert from computer science graduate working in a bank for 18 years to become to become a person who is teaching you online marketing today? Uh, I just like quit work for like three years ago lang. How did that happen? Because my mind got converted from an employee mind th- thinking, yung nag-complain lagi, yun yung employee mind nila, mahilig maghanap ng default, ng faults, into a mind of a marketer. What I'm having you do right now is to think like a marketer, kahit hindi kayo sanay. So, try again. Why? What does it mean if the people in Pinterest actually earn more uh, actually buy more than the people from Facebook. What does it mean for you? If you were going to sell something, what does it mean for you? Come on, sagutin nyo. May mga good, meron mga good answer, pero gusto ko mas mahabang, mas mahabang sagot. Ayun, tama si Susan. That's where your business should be seen. Okay? Tama si, hindi ko mabasa ang pangalan niya, si Mark. Malaki ang market, bibili, potential. Ayan. Diretsyo nyo naman yung sentence para maintindihan ko. Okay. Sabi, sabi naman ni Fibo, Pinterest is more on marketing, not just social network. Correct. People don't socialize here, no? They... Tama si Lord, yun mas tama. These people have more income. Or, even more than just more income. Kasi pwedeng mga tao sa Facebook mas more income eh. Not just more income. What else do people in Pinterest have? What's Pinterest? Uh, okay sa guessing, ano. Pinterest is more direct to the point. Tama yun. Tama yun. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Oy, namin sagot. <laughs> Profitability is higher to sell in Pinterest. Correct. It's better to post in Pinterest. Also correct. Pinterest is serious buyers. Correct. So, yan. Sa so, mga taong hindi alam ang sagot sa tanong ko. Okay. Uh, alam, masanay na kayo na ganito mag-isip. Masanay na kayo. Kasi this is how you convert from employee or small business to big business. Employee to big business. Employee to small business to big business. So, if you're serious about, you know, earning money from the internet, earning money from the, sa bahay nyo, sa your laptop, no, Pinterest is not like Sulit.com. Completely different. Sulit.com is a place for buying and selling. Pinterest is different focus. You'll see, you'll see. Malaking-malaking pagkakaiba ng Pinterest. I, I gave you an exercise kanina looking for beautiful pictures. If I say beautiful pictures, do you think of sulit? Probably not, no? Kasi hindi naman beautiful pictures ang sulit. Okay. So, my answer personally. Do you, do you guys want to know my answer to this? My own question. You, the, are you curious? Pwede namang here not. Okay lang. I will not answer na lang. I'll just let you answer.
Pwede, sabi ni Diane, pwede rin. Sige, um, no answer. So, mga ayaw marinig yung sagot, close your ears o mute nyo yung, sa, yung computer nyo. So, sabihin ko yung sagot para sa mga taong gusto malaman ng sagot. The meaning of this is Pinterest programs the person to buying before they go to the store. Facebook does not. Mas malakas ang programming ni Pinterest para bumili yung tao kaysa si Facebook. Facebook gives money to Shopify, but Pinterest gives more because of the way it programs the person. Ayan. <laughs> okay, tuloy na tayo. Tuloy na tayo. Next part. Okay, let's show you how Pinterest works. Okay? How Pinterest works. Okay. So I hope you get my point. We're doing this exercise so I can teach you all about this big, big social network, this big opportunity. They call this an opportunity kasi sa ka nakakakita ng social network na mas may tendency ang taong bumili, di ba? And why should, and why should you be uh, bored or you should be excited because wow, a place where a lot of people want to buy, you should want to be there because that's money for you, okay? Okay. Pero kung di nyo pa nag-gets, okay lang kasi the way we think naman of us employees, uh, I was uh, 18 years old, 18 years akong empleyado, I know some, what some people are thinking today. You're complaining. You're saying, ang tagal naman, tuloy mo na sa amin. Ayan, ano ba yan? Ang sabi mo, bilisan mo, ha? ganyan. Or, or galaw ng galaw yung screen. Di ko maintindihan. It's all complaints, right? Now, those are completely useless thoughts. Actually, if you think about it, when you, when you, when you're near your deathbed, you don't need it. You don't need all those complaining thoughts. Tama ba? What you do need are all the opportunity thinking. Or, uh, the, how can I maximize this opportunity? Hindi, I'm not talking about money lang, ha? Any kind of time you spend, you gotta maximize. Right now, you maximize by opening your mind to learn. Okay? I'm gonna teach you to be marketers. I'm gonna teach you how to use this tool. I hope you're excited to, do, to learn that. I'm not just gonna teach you skills. Okay, let's go. So, Pinterest in Tagalog is a virtual cork board or chalkboard. Ano ba? Ano ba board? Pin board. Virtual pin board. Hindi pala chalkboard. Okay? And, hindi siya Tagalog, ano? pero ganun talaga. <laughs> so, ano ba ginagawa sa pin board? Okay? Ang pin board, nilalagyan siya ng mga things na gusto mong matandaan. Ha? Gusto mong matandaan, nilagyan mo sa pin board. Ganun lang. So, that's it. That's, it. that's essentially it. But who would have thought that somebody making a virtual pin board would make people be addicted to pinning objects on that pin board? And this is what happens. No? It lets you, lets you, uh, wait a minute, so, Tapping my inyo, I'm just now. It lets you organize your pictures or videos or stuff into into ano into different categories. Okay, para siyang corkboard. Ayun pala corkboard. Pero itong corkboard na ito permanente, nasa internet. Okay? Tapos there's an infinite source of images. Okay? So, na-organize ka niyan. Tapos, what you do is you share what you love, the beautiful things you find online in so that people can see it. Okay? You share the beautiful things you find online so people can see it. So, ang itsura ng Pinterest, nakikita niya naman, pictures, pictures lang. Tapos on the left side, yung parang may wall, yung ginagawa ng mga tao. Activity, activity ticker katulad ng sa Facebook, sa kanan. I actually ignore that left side. Kasi yung ginagawa ng ibang tao. Okay? So, yun lang yun. ba Now, pag gumawa ang ibang tao, the other people, they create other boards, you can browse what they do. And this is what other people do, ah. most of it. Most of the, most of the people... They just look at other people's boards. And... Wait a minute, kapag mainit. Okay. Ay, nakamute ako. Sorry. Hello? You can hear me again. Okay, sorry. Namute ko sarili ko. Ang kulit eh. <laughs> okay. This board created by Martha Stewart. Okay? You can take a look at what she does and just... O, oh, siyasohin mo lang kung anong ginagawa ni Martha Stewart and... Hopefully, you learn something and you find something beautiful and then you get it, get the pictures that she creates. So, people use Pinterest for different things like to get wedding ideas. Okay, this is one example of wedding ideas. So, people who are not yet married, they want to get married, they look at an idea. Wow, ang ganda. Uh, gagawin ko yan. Pag kinasal ako. Oh, wow, ang ganda. Kinasal na ako. Pag gagawin ko yan para sa anak ko. They collect the pictures from other people's boards and put it in their own wall. Okay, that's one way. Um, Mouth-watering recipes. Have you ever seen people when before they eat, they take pictures first, right? And that's 
that's what they put in sa Pinterest pictures. Sometimes people make recipes, no? And then they put it in Pinterest. Most most of the time they just take pictures of photos, pictures of food they're about to eat and just put it in Pinterest. And if you, if you like it, no? If you like it, you just copy that picture into your own wall. Okay. Now, there's another one, do it do it yourself arts and crafts. They love this mga DIY ang tawag diyan. Gusto magandang tingnan, ganun. Mga bookcase na walang bookcase. Nakakita na kayo ng ganun. Or painted on na shelf. Wala talagang shelf. Ano lang. Pinaint lang. Mga ganyan. Anything na interesting. So pa is the quotes. Super popular ng Pinterest. Quotes. Grabe. Anything that inspires people or funny funny pictures. So parang pag nakakita ka ng cartoons, tapos andyan ang Pinterest, ilagay mo sa Pinterest, ganun. Nakakita ka ng something that inspires you in Facebook, copyin mo sa Pinterest. People really do that. And and my Pinterest is always littered with a lot of quotes na paulit-ulit or funny na natutuwa ako. Okay? So, sorry, it's nalit. So, Pinterest right now is uh, invite only. To join in Pinterest, okay, you have to be invited by somebody who's already a member of Pinterest. Okay? Do that. Um, you just go to this website, which is our mastery website, and just in ask people to invite you there. Okay? We have an official person who's actually inviting you, but kung hindi siya available, may mga rabid addicted people sa loob niya, na grupo na yan, na invite ka nila for fun sa Pinterest. Okay? For those of you who are chatting na faith, na faith, na <laughs> Nag-chat kayo sa chat room. Note na nire-record ko yung chat. So, if you... Please prevent yourself from typing anything personal in the chat room because you are being recorded and people will see what you're talking about. Thank you very much. Stick to the topic tayo ngayon, okay? Don't look for your one true love. Gawin nyo yung one true love hunting sa seminar ko. Okay? Pero wag sa chat room kasi nakikita ko yung ligawan ninyo eh. Okay? Thank you, next. Everybody... Sabihin nyo nga, lol. <laughs> Ay, nag echo ako. Shucks, hindi ko alam paano sa episode yan. Sandali ah. Tat, 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 tat. Tingnan ko, mayroon akong setting. Anybody else? How's my sound? Is it okay? Do you... Are you guys fine with the sound? Okay, eh, yan. Kasi mayroon nagpapakilala sa isa't isa eh. <laughs> so... To get an invite, I won't be able to invite you right now, so later you go to this website to get invited to Pinterest. Okay, you ask for an invite, then you use your Facebook or use whatever username password you want to log into your Pinterest. Okay, why you use your Facebook to log into Pinterest is use whatever system you want. Let's go into Pinterest 101. Go, go, go. Game na kayo, say yes. Yeah, low. Low, 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 low. Yes. Hi. So, what is a pin? A pin is an image that is pasted onto Pinterest. That is not true. The pin is anything you put on Pinterest, not necessarily an image. Basta anything na ilalagay mo sa Pinterest, ang tawag siya pin. Okay? So that's very simple. Okay? Next is this is a pin. So you're seeing the wisest mind has something ano yung nakasulat? Has something to learn. Yun ang sabi niya. Okay? The wisest man has Mind has something to learn. So, yun. Yun yung pin. Another pin. This is another pin that I'm about to show you, which is called an infographic. It's a, basically a big, 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 gigantic image na poster size na pinaliit. Pag kinlik mo yan, lalaki yan, makikita mo yung details. Normally, it's like funny and engaging. Isabi ng engaging, hindi ka makakatulog. Tapos makikita mo dyan, how the Academy Awards... Uh, determine who is going to win. Tapos, meron yung mga graph, gano'n. Yan yung na infographic for those of you na ngayon pa nakakita. Very popular sa Pinterest and very popular for people to use to promote themselves online. They create an infographic explaining their business or their product. Next is, this is a beautiful pin of a beach, uh, no, it's a beachside walkway with lights in Kao, Koh Tao, Thailand. Okay, so that's some inside of the world of Pinterest. Now, a pin board or a board is a set, okay? It's a set of pins, a collection of pins that you have collected for yourself uh, or collected by somebody else and they display nila sa Pinterest. So that's a pin board. Okay. 
So these are pin boards. Like under sa ilalim ng account mo, when you go to your own account, under that you see all the different kinds of boards. You can name them what you want and group them together. And so are these at taas naman sa akin. So I have boards called uh, Just Fun Infographics, inspiring you with words. You gotta buy these decals and cutting edge design. These are all my words, and I use these words para ma ano para matandaan ko. Para saan ba tong ano yung sorry yah. Para saan ba tong mga words na to? So I use that, okay? Uh, para para na hindi nyo bat bat kanya nyan. Ako nagpangalan nyan, okay? Next, let's click on one of the boards. So para makita natin. So just fun contains uh, pictures of uh, angry birds. Okay, kasi just fun lang, okay? And in sa loob ng just fun ko, mayroong picture ni Marilyn Monroe na rare because of this TV show called Smash. Tapos mayroong living room na floating yung, ano, yung couch. Tapos mayroong dito mga robots from sila Galactus, hindi nga robot yun eh. Si Daimos, yan. Uh, robots ng panahon ni, ni Bo Sanchez, saka si Battle, ano, Battle of the Planet. So, Angry Birds, just fun things for me. These are for me na fun. Okay, now I I created this one just for me, for myself. Okay, to express myself, to see that I consider these things fun. Now my board has sixty nine followers. Ah, uh, so, sorry, sixty nine pins, meaning sixty nine photos or images or or components. Okay, it also has three hundred and twenty seven followers. Okay, get ready. We're gonna think like a marketer again. I have sixty nine pins, essentially sixty nine photographs. And 327 followers. So if I put something new in this board, the followers will see the pictures or the videos. If I put anything in this board, the followers will see that. Here's the question, okay? Your pin board can be any topic, okay? You can create any pin board of any topic. Here's my question. If you have a blog or a Facebook, that has 327 followers. These are not your friends. In Pinterest, these are not my friends. I don't know who they are. And if you use... Echo. Nawala na echo. Hello? Okay na, nawala na echo. So I'm gonna ask again. If you have 327 readers of your blog, are you happy or not? Say, yes, I'm happy. Or no, I'm not happy. If you have 327 readers of your blog, readers of the website that you have created, are you happy or unhappy? Yes, you're happy. Remember, I just created the, that one no? a few months ago. So I immediately have 300 people reading that, that board. Now, question. What does 327 strangers following my board mean? What does it mean? Come on, think like a marketer. Ito ang isabihin ng think like a marketer before you accuse me of asking you to do something you cannot do. Use common sense. If you, go, if you have a product that you want to sell someday, someday, actually gusto mo na ibenta ngayon eh, pero I'm asking you to sell it later, someday, what does 327 followers mean to you? Come on, use common sense and tell me what is it? If you don't know the answer, be honest. Learn from everybody's answer. Tama si ano, just uh, VGP. Uh, hindi, si Lynn, Anna. They are, hindi, hindi ko matrack, si Emery. Si Emery ang tama. You have the same interest. Tama. 327 people have the same interest. Si Ellen then, they have the same interest as you. You consider the same things fun. Tama si Irish, may market ka. Correct. O, di ba ang galing? May market ka. And that's exactly what you want to do. When you're doing marketing, you're creating markets or you're looking for markets. Yes? And this is 327 people who have the same interests as you. Pareho kayong mag-isip. Okay? And they are actually, everybody, almost everybody is correct in saying they are potential buyers. But not just that. They are they think like you do when it comes to fun. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, since can be any topic, no? a pin board can be any topic. So every, oh, by the way, uh, let me just go back and just, can you just say congratulations to everyone who got it? Just say congrats. Everyone who got what that means, 327 followers, okay? 
Kasi once you put a picture there that sells a product, the 327 can see it. Because they're following you. Ganun naman yun eh. Okay. Okay. So let's... Uh, for those of you who na naninibago sa paggagamit ng common sense, because for me, mo, most of marketing is common sense, but we're not used to applying common sense, just learn from the answers. Then you realize, alam ko din yun ah. Kaya ko din isipin yun ah. Bakit hindi ko nasabi yun? Ayan, kasi maybe your mind is so full of complaints or or looking for problems. Ano kayong problema ni John Mark? Ano kayong diferensya niya? Kaya niya ginagawa. Ay mga ganun, you're wasting your time focusing on the wrong things. So you got to focus on the right things so you can answer my questions. Because your freedom, freedom from whatever you're doing right now, if you want to be free of it, will probably be answered best by giving you the capacity to earn more. Okay? Victor, if you're looking for a chat room, go to the justin.tv. Okay? 28 people want to enter GoToWebinar. So if you want to leave the GoToWebinar and go to justin.tv for a chat room, go ahead. Join them there. Okay, very good. Our system here in uh, GoToWebinar doesn't have a chat room that you guys can see. I can see it. But if you want to see super interaction, dun ka sa almost 100 people sa justin.tv. Okay, next, next. So, give you, I'll give you an example of the things people actually put inside the pin boards. Do you know the movie where Jack Nicholson and Morgan Freeman got on an airplane and went skydiving? What is that movie? What is that movie where Morgan Freeman and Jack Nicholson went to China and drove a bike on the Great Wall of China? What is that movie? Do you know that movie? Yes. That movie is called The Bucket List. Okay, and here's that the cover of that movie. And The Bucket List, uh, before they're about to die, they made a list before na gusto namin ma-achieve. Gusto namin ma-achieve before kami mamatay. Okay? So, ang title ng movie, The Bucket List, if you haven't watched it, please go watch it. It's very good in focusing yourself, you know, getting rid of your focus for complaints and looking for defects. Because hindi, hindi naman ako kumpanya mo eh. So, you're not, you know, don't look for my defects. I didn't hire you to do that. In the company, you're a good asset because you are hired to look for defects. Here, look for the p things you love to do. And the bucket list, which is things you love to do. Alam niyo mga libro, nakalagay, 100 things to do before you die. 1,000 places to visit before you die. That's a bucket list. And the bucket list is one of the most popular things people put inside Pinterest. Okay? All the other things are the, the children and dream home nila, places you want to visit, things they want to do, and the bucket list. Places they want to visit, things they want to do. That's the thing they want to do inside uh, uh, inside Pinterest. They fill Pinterest with their uh, dreams and hopes. Okay, here's a question from me to you. You know the things I want to do, things I want to have, things I want to possess, things I want to be. But things I want to be, hindi pera yan, Minsan pera. I want to be kinder. I want to be cute. Minsan pera, minsan hindi. What does it mean to you as a person who is in the marketing field? Okay. Uh, again, you're not in the marketing field, but you actually have no choice if you want to pursue this business called work from home or earning from the computer. Earning from the computer, you gotta have this way of thinking of being a marketer. Which means, you gotta tell me, if you people put things I wanna, if people put things I wanna do in Pinterest, what does it mean to you? If people place things I wanna buy in Pinterest, what does it mean to you? Kaya niyan. yan. Sige na. Kaya niyan. yan. No, 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 I'm not asking you for your bucket list. <laughs> I'm not asking you for your bucket list. <laughs> Hello. Ah, nakamute ba ako? Sandali lang at tingnan ko lang kung nakamute ako. Hindi, hindi ako nakamute eh. Hi, I'm not asking you for your bucket list. If people use Pinterest like a confession box of this is what I want to be, this is what I want to do, this is what I want to buy, what does it mean to you? Kuha na na Pinky, syempre. Pinky Peregrine got it. Hindi ko muna sasabihin sa inyo. Gusto ko isipin niyo muna. 
Irish Duran got it straight up. I'm gonna tell you the answer. Ready? You know what to offer them to buy. That's the answer. They already told you what they want. So you know exactly what to offer them to buy. How many here didn't get it? Just tell me. Just be honest. You didn't get it. I didn't get it. I didn't get it. Frowny face. Kung gusto frowny face. Kung hindi siya nagigit. Tama si Bolda. I can give them the things they need. Correct. Yeah. Ayan, so you you guys you guys gotta learn how to find the obvious, huh? Because I'm using the word common sense, but it's really the obvious. If I just said, I'll I'll tell you how obvious this is. Sabi niyo sa akin ano ano obvious obvious. If I just said, "Oi, gusto ko ng ice cream, ice cream, ice cream," pa ulit ulit sa Pinterest. Because I'm using the Pinterest, pa ulit ulit eh. Gusto ko ng magandang bahay, magandang bahay, magandang bahay, magandang bahay. Ano ano stingin mo? Ano ano stingin mo sa akin? Ayoko ba na magandang bahay? O gusto ko na magandang bahay? Really? Di ba common sense? Araw-araw, sinetiklare ko sa Pinterest. Gusto ko magandang bahay, gusto ko mag-travel, gusto ko magandang bahay, gusto ko mag-travel. What do you think I am? Silang plaka? Eh, there's several million of us na ganoon. Silang plaka. Di ba? In a word, it's called opportunity. Tama si Alan. Opportunity. And if you are going to in, go into this business of marketing, which you have no choice, kasi ganyan ang business ng, ano, ng earning online, you gotta learn to recognize the opportunity. And that's the opportunity. Sinabi na nila eh. Now, here, here's the nice thing about it. In Facebook, they don't say that. What, I want this. They don't say that. Di ba? Ito yung sa Facebook, I went there, I ate that. Okay, let me go to the next part. I hope you learned a lot from that exercise. Go, go, go. Now, if you wanna see what others are doing, okay, okay, or pinning or repinning. Repinning means getting somebody else's pin, uh, photos and put it in your own collection. What you do is you follow the boards of a Pinterest user. And this is how you follow the board, okay? Uh, you look for a board or look for a person that you like, okay? And let's say Martha Stewart. Most of the home 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 brands are in Pinterest, okay? So you go there and you click sa baba. If you want to follow all her boards, just click on follow all. Yung red na button sa ilalim ng pangalan ni Martha Stewart, just click on follow all and you're gonna see everything that Martha Stewart does. I do that sometimes to people but it's really weird because minsan, papakitaan ako ng mga fashion models, mga baka bag, may mga uh, damit na pang babae, hindi mga natutuwa eh kasi gusto ko lang yung mga jokes niya. So, what I do is I don't follow all, I want to follow a specific board of a person. So, I just go to the board of that person, I select the board and use the follow sa ilalim niya. Meron yung follow na button sa ilalim. And that's what I do. Para hindi ako na, ano, na lilito. Dami-dami naman, hindi ko naman gusto. So, kung gusto mo food lang ni Martha Stewart, kitchen lang ni Martha Stewart, ignore everything else. Yung, meron siyang lookbook where yung itsura niya, yung pictures ng pets niya, hindi ka interesado. Follow only the boards. Okay? Now, you can also follow, unfollow boards. Halimbawa, ay, sawang-sawa na ako dito sa mga pictures ng pets ni Martha Stewart. Ah, unfollow ko siya. So, unfollow mo. Just go ahead and go to the board and unfollow it. They'll never know if you unfollow them. So, walang hard feelings. And since nandiyan tayo sa follow, please go to pinterest.com slash jomarhilario after you have your own account to follow my Pinterest account. Okay? Kailangan muna meron kayong sariling account before nyo ako makafollow. Okay, dokes? So, just keep it in mind. Okay? They won't know if you unfollow them. I won't know if you unfollow me. I'll only know na ay kumonti nag-follow sa akin. Pero actually, hindi man importante. Kasi importante sa Pinterest is self-expression. This is what I want. I'm gonna show the world. That's the mindset of people in Pinterest. Now, just go to click unfollow, which is the same place where you look for the follow. Para ma-unfollow mo yung board. You can follow just a board or an entire person. Pag mayroon kayong ini-stock sa Pinterest, i-follow mo lahat. Pag wala kayong ini-stock, i-follow nyo lang yung board. Jomar, paano ka malalaman ng board? Pag bukas mo sa Pinterest, para siyang may categories, art, travel, Puntahan mo yung categories, hanap ka ng picture na gusto mo, click mo, pin mo, gano'n. Tapos pag-trip mo talaga lahat ng, gusto, ng pinaglagawa niya, i- ibig sabihin, you like the person's taste in beauty. That's what it means. You follow the person or you follow the boards the, of the person. Okay? So that's what you do. You look for the categories in Pinterest and then you just follow, follow whatever your heart leads you. O di ba ang drama? Okay. Now, repin. A repin is adding an image you find 
while browsing Pinterest. A repin. Uulitin mo yung pin. Now, lalagay mo yun sa sarili mong board. Okay, let me show you how that's done. Repinning is the most popular task in Pinterest. If, question, what is the most popular task people do in Facebook? Sige, ikaw. Ano yung majority of the time you are doing in Facebook? Consuming. Huwag na sumagot yung mga addicted sa Farmville, ha? Or SimCity. Ano ang pinaka-normal task sa Facebook na lagi mong ginagawa? Yung pinaka-madalas. Minsan, scroll wheel lang laging ginagalaw. Yung scroll wheel ng mouse mo, yun lang kalaro mo. Talaga, like. <laughs> ah, sabihin ko sa inyo, sagot ko. Ah. Scroll. <laughs> Tama si Ellen. I don't think you guys do like as much as you scroll. Tama ba ako? Most of us, hindi tayo pwedeng mabuhay ng walang scrolling sa wall. Tama ba? Minsan di ka nagla-like. Minsan di ka nag-share. Pero nag-scroll down ka. Tama ba? Tama? So, if the most popular thing to do in Facebook is scrolling, the most popular thing to do in Pinterest is scrolling and repinning. Sa Facebook, is scrolling and liking. Okay? When you're getting status updates, Scroll down, kala scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. Ano nangyari? Ano nangyari? Ano nangyari? Di ba ganon? So, tandaan nyo, ang repinning is the most popular task. So, let me go through the entire thing again. So, it's just like Facebook's share. It's not a like. Okay? It's not a like, it's not a comment, it's a share. So, I will take that photo or video from somebody's Pinterest, kay Jomar, sa Time Magazine, sa Wall Street Journal, para sa Tumblr, And I'm gonna take that person's image and put it in my own board. So here's how it works. Ito yung mindset, ah. Ang nasa pinboard mo, akin na. Lalagay ko sa pinboard ko. That's the mindset of people repinning. Ang nasa pinboard mo, akin na. Lalagay ko sa pinboard ko. Okay. So here's another question for you marketers out there. What does that mean for you? Ano naman yan? Ano dapat mong gawin? Ano to, ah? Common sense din to. Kaya nyo yan. Kaya nyo yan. Ang nasa pinboard mo, akin na, lagay ko sa pinboard ko. Yung sinasabihan ng tao na to, ikaw. Ikaw ang marketer. Pwede bang sabihin nyo sa chatroom kung nag-agree kayo, uh, I am a marketer. Pag hindi, sabihin nyo, nope, I'm not. <laughs> kasi ito ang goal natin. I'm telling you to be a marketer kasi wala kayong choice. You need to be like that. Sa pag-iisip, hindi career ha, sa pag-iisip, para kumita na malaki sa internet. Kailangan mag-marketer ang pag-iisip para lumaki, lumaki ang pagkita. Eto, tanong. Gusto mo malaki kita mo sa internet? Say yes. Say yes. Kung gusto mo malaki kita mo sa internet, say yes. Okay. If you said yes, your path leads to becoming a marketer. Kahit ba VA ka, kahit ba business owner ka, kahit doktor ka, dentista ka, marketer ka pa rin. It's the way of thinking. It's not a career. Okay? It's a way of thinking. Pag-iisip. And I'm training you how to think like, like a marketer. Uh, basically, it took me several years to become like this. So, I'm just fast-tracking you guys. Kasi wala namang nagturo sa akin kundi libro ni Dan Kennedy. Okay? <laughs> so, here it is. Pag sinabi ng kliyente, ang nasa pinboard mo, mo, Leilani, Diana, Fibo, Janet, Susan, Nino, Ramon, Renante, Gemma, Thelma, Emery, Akina, ilalagay ko sa pinboard ko. Anong gagawin mo? What does it mean to you? Ano ang gagawin mo? Sinakanya. Sisingilin. Come on! What's the obvious thing? The answer is already in the question. Actually, the answer is already in the question. Come on, it's the obvious thing. Huwag ka magja-jump. Huwag ka magja-jump. Sabi sa inyo, ang marketing medyo common sense. The answer is already in the question. Come on. Tama si Alejandro. Pero you gotta use the same words as I uh, in the question. Kasi sinagot ko na actually yung tanong ko eh. Alam mo yan? Don't use marketing words. I don't use marketing words. Kaya Tagalog na yan eh. Ano dapat mong gawin? Pag sinabi niyang gawin to, ano dapat mong gawin? Sabi mo, sabi mo, sabi mo. Ano dapat mong gawin? 
Kuha na ni Franz. Kuha na ni Franz. Kuha ni Irma, kuha ni Franz. Sabihin ko na sa inyo. Sabihin nyo, yes. Ayan na, tama si Olivia. Tama si Alejandro. Uh, ibigay mo sa kanya. Humihinihingi niya yung nasa pinboard mo, di ba? Ibigay mo sa kanya. Hindi mo siya bebentahan. Kasi yung nasa pinboard mo, pictures lang. Bibigyan mo pa siya ng marami pang pictures. Ibibigay mo sa kanya yung gusto niya. Pag kinuha niya yung mga pictures mo na nakakatawa, bigyan mo pa siya ng more pictures na nakakatawa. Gets? Ah? Sabihin mo nga sa akin kung common sense ang marketing. Sabihin nyo nga. Kung hindi common sense, sige lang. Sabihin, sabihin sa akin, mali ka, Jomar. Hindi naman common sense yun. Eh. Pag sinabi niyang, akin na yan, lalagay ko sa pinboard ko, hindi naman obvious na kailangan kong ibigay sa kanya. <laughs> Ano yun? Hi, D. Ngayon talaga, pag hindi ka pa sanay sa marketing, malalos ka talaga. Ganun talaga. Okay lang yun. Di ba? If the person is asking, kanina pa ako pa ulit-ulit, di ba? Gusto kong ice cream. Gusto kong ice cream. Gusto kong ice cream. Anong gagawin mo? Di ba? O, oh, kuha nyo na, di ba? So, hindi mo siya bebentahan. Hindi mo rin siya sisingilin. Ibibigay mo lang yung gusto niya. More pictures of ice cream. More pictures of ice cream. More pictures of ice cream. If you're not selling ice cream, then it doesn't matter. You don't have to be selling ice cream. Okay? Super common sense lang. Ngayon. Okay. Ibigay mo, kung kaya mo ibigay yung physical ice cream, go ahead. Kung hindi mo kaya ibigay, bigay mo yung pictures ng ice cream. Kasi baka naman hindi niya binibenta mo. Okay, let's proceed. I hope you learned something from that exercise, which is actually just a repeat of kanina. Go, go, go. Now, para mag-repin, turo ko sa inyo. You bring your mouse pointer over the image na trip ninyo. Okay? Tapos, lalabas ito. Yun. Since hindi mo siya makita, palalakihin ko. O, di ba? Ang galing. So, lumaki na siya. Makalagay dyan, repin, like, comment. Repin, like, comment. Yan yung nakalagay. Obviously, lalagay mo, pipiliin mo yung repin na option. Okay? Tapos, pag-click mo dun, meron lalabas na kahon. Yung kahon na yan, merong board, description, tsaka pin it. Just select the correct board or click on the drop down so you can uh, pick your own board, yung drop down, click mo yan. Tapos hanapin mo yung board mo. Okay? So these are the boards you created earlier. Then you, you change the description if you want. Normally you should change the description pero tamad ng mga tao sa Pinterest, they don't change it kasi gusto ko lang yung picture na yan, done. Pipin ko na agad. Kasi all they want is to collect pictures, collect pictures. As marketers, that's not what we're gonna do. Ah. We're just gonna collect pictures that people love also. Pero sila ang gagawin nila yung mga users ng Pinterest, collect lang sila ng collect. Ngayon, lagay mo na yung pictures ng tao sa sarili mong board. That's how a repin is done. I took a picture of a, of a stackable furniture na mukhang statue na nagiging chairs. Nilagay ko siya sa for the home na board ko. Actually, kay Nikito na board. Okay. So that's how you categorize uh, no, uh, pins. You create a, a pin board and you put pictures there, or you just create a new pin board. To create a new pin board is easy. Just, pag nandun ka na sa create a new pin, okay, you just scroll down until there's a blank there, okay, hello, and then there's a create new board, and click on the create new board thingy there, and you'll be able to create a new board. Warning, the name of your board must be meaningful. You can use a creative name as long as people know what you're talking about. Huwag kang magpaka-weirdo and say random randomness. Unless ang laman lang talaga niya random randomness. If you want people to follow that board, make sure when they read the name of the board, they know what it is. Okay. Because you need to create boards that gets people's attention and get people to follow that board. One way is make sure that the board's contents, yung mga pins niya interesting. Okay? The other way is name it correctly so that they know they know exactly what it stands for. Okay, next. Then you click on create and there you have it. You click on pin and success. Nandiyan na yung pin. Ang ginagawa ng tao pagkatapos mag-repin, they just go and repin again. Look for another photo. Look for another photo. Repin. Sabi niya, addictive to. Ginagawa ko rin to lang madalas. Okay. Hindi dumalabas ang araw na hindi ako nag-repin. Okay, next. You are gonna ask me, about this. The, inter the employee mind is gonna ask me, what is the legality of that? You are getting other people's pictures and putting it in your own, right? Question. 
when you go to Facebook and you share an image, did you check the legality of that? When you like an image in Facebook, did you check the legality of that? You probably have no right to share that image in your wall. Correct. Same issue with Pinterest. So if you have any issues with pictures and Pinterest, you should have an issue with pictures and Facebook. Kasi parehong pareho. Awesome. Okay. So, next, next. So, liking a pin adds the image to the your profile. Oh, sorry, sorry. Before, before we even get confused now, you can like a pin. But this is not the most popular activity in Pinterest. There's a like and there is a share. Uh, there is a repin. Now, let me just define to you what a like is. A like is when you go to the bottom of your own profile, meron tong nakalagay na activity tapos may likes. Okay? Meron boards, pins, likes, activity. And yung mga likes, dito lumalabas lahat ng pins na nilike mo. Ang problem is, pag ginamit mo yung like, ang ibig sabihin nun, I have no idea how am I going to categorize this pin. So I'm just gonna put it, I'm just gonna like it. I don't have a board where I can put this pin in. So I'll just like it. So that's what it means. Yun ang sabihin ng like. Parang, Sige, mamaya ako na ikakategorize yan. Huwag yung gagawin yan ha. As businesses or as marketers, do not like, uh, if you're gonna use Pinterest for for business purposes, do not just like. Uh, lagay mo yung board. Lagay mo yung board. Gawa ka ng board for it. Okay? Kasi, isabihin, hindi ka organized. Okay? Yung like kasi can grow to as many as several thousand pictures. Tapos pag tingin mo, walang organization, walang sense, nobody will follow it. Kasi they can't follow a like. They can only follow boards. Okay? So, I hope you... I hope you 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 remember that you must repin and put in a board instead of like. Edoki. Hope you learned that. Something, something. Okay. The more you repin, the, more, the bigger your Pinterest boards will get. Yes? Tama ba? Obvious ba? Yes? Sabi nyo yes sa chat room. Okay? Pwede ba mag-dislike? Tanggalin mo yung picture sa ano mo, sa, sa board mo. Pwede naman tanggal ng picture. Pwede ka mag-dislike. <laughs> okay. So, again, the more you repin, the bigger your Pinterest board becomes. The bigger your Pinterest board means you have lots of images. When you have lots of images, there's more popularity. If there's more popularity, there are more followers of your boards because mas marami silang nakikitang pictures, mas maraming chances to be seen. Do you agree? Say yes or no. Bagong yes to. Pag malaki yung board mo, marami kang images. Marami kang images, marami kang popularity, marami kang followers. Why would people want to follow you? Because they see your pictures. Pag tatlo lang ang laman ng Pinterest mo, makikita ko lang ang picture mo today. Bukas hindi ko na makikita yan. Kasi matatabunan ng pictures mo ng mga pictures ng ibang tao. Just like the wall in Facebook. So, tataas ang popularity mo kung madalas ka nagpipin. So, I'm gonna show you what do people pin. Okay? What do people pin? Here it is. Now, in a survey of Pinterest users, people can actually pick more than one answer. So don't try to compute the 100%. The majority of people in Pinterest pin food pictures, food videos, home, followed by arts, followed by style, followed by products, followed by vacation, humor, travel, children, other, and 20% inspiration and education. Question. Nasabihin niya. Anong isabihin yan? Kung ito ang gusto ng taong pinipin sa Pinterest, anong ibig sabihin yan sa'yo? Assume natin, ano, travel agency ka. So, obviously, trip na trip mo yung travel, 20%. So, ang pinaka-obvious na common sense ay, anong lalagay mo sa Pinterest mo pag ikaw ay travel agency? Tama si Olivia, demand. But try to answer in a complete sentence so you know I can get it. If you are in a travel agency, you'll probably use 20 to 22% travel. Yes? If you are real, selling real estate, you'll probably keep pinning or upload pictures of home. Right? Siyempre, obvious yun, di ba? Yun ang common sense. Ano pa? So, ito yung magdadagdag ka sa common sense. Pero nasa screen na yung sagot. Sabihin nyo na kung gusto mong sagutin ko na lang. Ha? Para sabihin mo, ang galing ko naman. Di ba? Maganda sabihin mo yun, ang galing ko naman, naisip ko yun. Di ba? I'm asking you the questions because I want you guys to think like marketers. If you think like a marketer, kita talaga kayo ng malaki. 
Tama si Ina Alcantara. Tama si Bang Gonzales. Add food pins to your travel pins. Add humor to avoid boredom. Tama sila. That's the second thing. If you are selling products, people already pin product pictures. Just add something else. And my suggestion is add inspiration or education, info, infographics, uh, quotes to your home, to your food, to your humor, to your vacation, to your travel pictures. So, hindi ka boring na panika pictures ng places to go, but you also have interesting things na pwedeng lang ipin. So, you are like a human being in Pinterest. You, you pin things that are interesting, that people love to pin. Don't just market paulit-ulit ka lang picture ng albeyo, 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 araw-araw, albeyo. Wala kang mag-pin sa mga pins mo pag panay albeyo, araw-araw. Pero pag meron ka inspiring, inspiring, pipin nila. Ayun, yung ginagawa sa Pinterest. Guess nyo na, hindi ko na ulitin yun. Next. Next na ako, next. Okay. So, let me show some demographics. Ito lang naman yun. Right now, when Pim when Pinterest started, 80% of the, of, of the users are female. The number of male people are growing. Siguro 30% na yan. Kasi March siya. Eh. March to kinuha. This is mostly female ang Pinterest. So here's the question. Why Pinterest? Let me show you a case study. Yeah, kulog. Pilipinas to eh. May kulog dito. Let me show you a case study why should you use Pinterest. This is a company called Wayfair. Wayfair is just like your typical department store. They sell furniture, deco, bread and bath, clothes, and stuff like that. Okay? They're just like Shopify, only pang bahay. Okay? In Wayfair, sabi nila, sabi ng CEO ng Wayfair, Pinterest users are 10% more likely to make a purchase than visitors who arrive from other social networks. They more likely make a purchase. Next. Including Facebook and Twitter. And they also spend 10% more on average. Dun sa Shopify, 40% ang mas maraming binibili ng Pinterest users. Sa Wayfair, 10% more ang binibili nila. And this is another company na hiwalay. So the reason I'm showing this to you, because sabi ng CEO nila, ang, sa tingin niyang dahilan, kaya nagkaganan yun, is because visual imagery drives inspiration. It's what it makes, it's what makes you want to buy the product if you see the product, even if online. Sabi ni Niraj siya. Siya yung CEO ng Wayfair. They have actual results where they use Pinterest versus Twitter versus Facebook and still, people in Pinterest buy more because the visual thing, so, malaking difference nito sa ano, sa sulit, no? Sulit is mostly text, Pinterest is mostly images, and people are inspired to buy even more, no? Inspired is the word. Okay. So yeah, so that's uh that's the Pinterest story for today. Okay, so I have a question. Did you learn anything today? Did you learn anything? Can you tell me what you learned? And if you learned anything today, would this be useful for your future, uh, you know, endeavors of marketing online? Maging useful na ba siya? So alam niyo na how to think. At least you got an idea how to. How to change the way you think. Oh, kumukulog sa Pilipinas. Okay. At least na no, na-experience niya yung Pilipinas na totoo. Okay? So, you can apply this by learning about Pinterest, by using Pinterest first. Wag mo i na magaling ka sa marketing agad. Gamitin mo muna sa Pinterest, tapos eventually you, you can figure out kung ano pinagsasasabi ni Jomar. Ah, ito pala yung repin. Ah, ito pala yung board. Ito pala yung mga popular na Pinterest users. By the way, the most popular Pinterest users are not celebrities unlike Twitter and Facebook. They are people. <laughs> Normal people. The companies have yet to discover Pinterest. Alam niyo bang hindi pa popular ang Pinterest sa malalaking kumpanya? Ang alam pa lang kung na malalaki is mga home at saka some Time Magazine and Wall Street Journal. Sila pa lang may Pinterest. Okay? So, there's a big opportunity for you guys to get into Pinterest and become experts in marketing. Okay? So, I'm gonna ask you, do you, who, got, who here wants to learn how to promote a business and a blog in Facebook in Pinterest? You wanna learn that? So, if you wanna learn that in depth, 
Um, I told you basics. By the way, one-on-one pa lang to, ah. Basics pa lang to, ah. Baka isipin nyo, yan na lang yun. Siyempre, hindi. Marami pa yan. We're just, I just gave you an hour uh, orientation on how to use Pinterest and how to think like a marketer. Now, I gotta... I want to teach you how to use Pinterest. Why? Because if you are using Pinterest versus everybody else... By the way, can you answer me this question? Um, ikaw pa lang ba, sa mga kakilala mo ang gumagamit ng, ang alam ang Pinterest. Sa mga kakilala mo, sabi mo, yes, if you're the only person sa mga kakilala mo na nag-orient sa Pinterest ngayon. So, is it safe to assume that among all your friends, ikaw yung best na maging expert sa Pinterest? Kasi, may orientation ka pa nga mula sa akin. Okay, di ba? Kasi when you become a VA, a virtual assistant, no? And you say to your client, Ah, uh, lagay mo sa resume mo. Marunong ka mag Pinterest marketing. Mas mataas ang demand sa iyo. Taas ang demand, mataas ang kita. Ay mo maging VA. Gusto mo maging online marketer. You want to market your company. Now you know how. So that's why I'm teaching Pinterest to you. Because this is like the gold rush. This is like the opportunity na wala pa masyadong nakakakita and I'm already showing it to you. Now we used common sense, ha, just to prove to you that this opportunity is real. Plus used two case studies of companies sa internet na kumikita na sa Pinterest. And these are physical, yung Shopify, they're digital store. Yung Wayfair, that's a physical store. Okay? So, physical, digital store, they both make money from Pinterest. Okay? So, you can charge higher rate as a virtual assistant when you learn Pinterest. Or, you can earn more money by maximizing Pinterest as an online marketer. So, ikaw, you can promote yourself as the Pinterest marketer to companies. Okay? This is my reason why I teach this. Okay? Or, if you don't want to do that, you can do it for your own company. Ikaw ang Pinterest marketer sa company mo. Okay? So, here's an example of what I mean. Okay? This is a picture of a Pinterest wa a wall. Kung ano man tawag that, board. And this contains a blog post. These just don't contain pictures. If you click on each one of those, it will send you to an article in a website. And I'm, I can teach you how to do this. You know? uh, how to effectively do it and how to track it. Kung nag-work ba talaga yan? Kasi pwedeng sabihin ni Jomar, ay, ang galing, ano? Instead na pupunta ka sa Google, pupunta ka na lang sa Pinterest para magbasa ng websites. Which is true. Does it work? I'm also, I can also teach you that. Paano mo malalaman if it works? How to do that and how do you figure out how this thing works? And how do you know if people are actually clicking on it to read your website or not? Because when they click on the pictures, they don't go to Pinterest. They go to the website and read your blog post. Or go to Facebook, no? So that's one of the things I can teach you guys. Plus, I can also teach you online event marketing. So I'm, I'm telling you already the things I can teach you. Huh? Online event marketing, why do I want to teach you that? Because uh, there are companies who demand that you know event marketing. So you can fill up their events, or if you have events as, as a business person, you can fill up your events. So it's a very, very important skill to learn as a VA or a business person. So I can teach you that. I, you can also learn how to create sales letters and how to track the effectivity of sales letters. Why, why is that important? So you will know how to sell on, online using simple words, just words. Okay. So I hope you, you guys are saying yes to this because these are... Very important skills to know. If you are a VA, you know how to do sales letter creation and tracking. Okay? Sales letter creation, $2,000 course yan. Hindi akin yun. Kay, kay John, John Carlton na, na course yan. Tap, yung tracking, hindi pa tinuturo ni John Carlton. Yung creation pa lang. So I can teach you that para you can sell yourself as a person who knows how to do sales letter creation and tracking. Or you can do it to sell your, your own products online. I can also teach you how to design... Uh, how to use a uh, marketing WordPress theme. Kung ano man yan. It's something that people use to simplify uh, simplify their life as a marketer. So, if you know how to use that marketing theme for WordPress, marketers will want to hire you at a higher rate because there are very, very, very few, probably zero, people sa mga online marketplaces na, nag, na nagsasabi na marunong sila ng mga marketing themes na tuturo ko sa inyo. And pag natutunan nila yan, pag natutunan, hindi yan today, workshop ko to eh, 
I'm just telling you what I'm gonna, what I can teach you guys, okay? Ah, uh, pagkatotohanan niyo yung yung skill na yan na using that marketing WordPress team, pwede kayong pag-agawan talaga literally ng mga taong nag-hire sa internet kasi marunong kayo niyan. Okay? Either they get you for a higher rate or you become a marketer na madali ang buhay kasi ano, kasi yun ang role ng marketing teams for WordPress. Okay. So, you can also learn how to use social media statistics. So, just to frame whatever I'm talking about, the things that I can teach you, I can all teach you this, all of this, in five days. Okay? In five days. So, I got I got a workshop coming up in August 24-25. That's the beginning. And a total of five days, I can teach you all of this. So, let me continue. Why would you want to know social media statistics? Because it's in understanding social media statistics, meaning... Effective ba tong tweet na to? Effective ba tong blog post na to? Effective ba tong Facebook post na to? Kasi it will help you convert the 10,000 peso sale to 100,000 peso sale because you know what to change. That's that's the use of social media statistics and I can teach you that in the workshop. Okay? You can also learn how to create membership sites which is essentially a very advanced topic that very very few people know how but you have seen a membership site and it's called Facebook. Diba? Facebook, ang in-earn ng Facebook, mga several billion dollars. Ah. Alam niyo ba yan? Okay? And that's a membership site. If you don't know what a membership site is, congratulations, every day you go to that membership site. It's called Facebook. I can teach you how to make something like that. And this is a membership site that actually earns money for you. Or you can be the person that an online marketer will hire to make a membership site for him. You can be that person or you can hire, be hired as a virtual assistant to create membership sites. Essentially, these are skills that I can teach you because I do it, do this essentially every day so that you can be seen as highly valued dun sa online market. So I can all teach you this stuff in a five-day event. Oh, well, I'll, I'll, I'll go into detail about the workshop in a bit. Okay? Kasi hindi pa tayo tapos. Okay. I think, lastly, I'm gonna teach you social media contest management because alam niyo mga contest na paramihan ng likes, illegal yun eh. I'm gonna teach you how to manage social media contests uh, using the blog, using Facebook, using Twitter, using Pinterest, okay? So that it will help you increase the number of prospects for yourself, for your company, or for your clients if you are a VA. Okay? This is all going to be part of my upcoming workshop. So here is the workshop proper on if you want to know all of those things, you just have to attend the hands-on workshop the VA Expert Hands-On Workshop on August 24 to 25. And that is a hands-on event happening in Manila. But don't worry if you're not in Manila. Uh, because mamaya na yan. You can also download it. Okay? You can also download this. There are 40 plus seats available only. Okay? So if you're not able to come to Manila August 24, 25, you got a treat because you can download the event. This is not live streaming. Huh? You don't have to be in the computer on August 24. You wait one week after August 24, and then we're going to send you the video, the audio, and the PDF. But that is not all. Okay? Okay? The total is actually five days, and let me dis discuss that. There's going to be a 90-minute webinar on Monday, August 20, at 8 p.m. I will orient you. Yes, pwede siyang i-download. I will orient you. Online, so you don't have to be in the Philippines, on what to expect sa, sa seminar, sa workshop, kasi hands-on siya. Everybody who downloads the workshop will attend this. If you cannot attend it, we have a recording. Then, the two-day event will happen sa Market Market Mall, sa Be Connected Internet Cafe, sa Bonifacio Global City, office hours, 9 a.m. to 6 p.m., including food na yan and snacks, okay? And computer and internet, just bring a ball pen. That's all I'm gonna ask you. Dala lang kayo ng ball pen. So, bibigyan din namin kayo ng ball pen. Anyway, may handout siya. You get to take home the PDF, you know, the, the presentations and the step-by-step. -step. There's hands up, there's paper handout and there's digital handouts. Okay. For those of you who download, you wait for one week before you get the video of this event. And then after that, we are going to meet with my July. Di ba, nag-workshop ako ng July. We're gonna meet those people, or was it May? And those people is gonna meet you uh, nag-attend na sila ng workshop before, September 22 sa October 27, meron tayong dalawang half-day seminar. So, total of five days. 
September 22, October 27. Again, if you download this, you can attend this or download the video, audio, and, and PDF. I hope, you, I hope you get it. Medyo mabilis. If you download, you attend everything. Okay? Nakamute ako. Hello? Yeah. If, if you download, you attend everything except for the hands-on. So, August 24, 25. But if you download, you can also attend the two-day, half-day seminar. You can attend the webinar also. And if you, uh, actually, if you attend the hands-on, you get to attend the webinar, you go to the hands-on, and then you attend the two-day, half-day seminar. Uh, Follow-up sessions. Okay? So, a total of five days para matutunan nyo lahat yan. Okay? So, sorry. So, let's talk about your bonuses. Okay? So, there, there's certain stuff you can you can get from this, not just the actual stuff, event marketing, Pinterest marketing. I, did I forget to mention, I'm going to talk about in detail how to do Pinterest marketing. Event marketing, Pinterest marketing, social media marketing, contest management, uh, event marketing, and uh, the rest of the list I gave earlier. And some of the bonuses that you can get. Let me just uh, go through this. Ayan, may tanong. Yung tanong nyo, later, ha? Okay. Okay. So, the, the first bonus is a, a set of success team wallpapers. Just for fun, I had my VA create set, some wallpapers to display in your computer, in your iPhone, in your wallpaper, or in Pinterest and Facebook para ma-expire kayo. A lot of people, we need to be reminded that we must be successful. So, I created that for you. Another bonus is a way to declutter your computer files. It's an e-presentation. I, I actually have five computers and I know how to organize the files so I don't waste space. I have backups all over the place and I don't slow up my computer. I'm going to tell you how I do it because I know you need it. Kahit na ayaw mong i-admit, ang bagal ng computer mo dahil ang daming junk. Okay, next is success secrets, literature courses, and e-presentation. What does it contain? This is a bonus if you avail of the, the workshop, download or live. Ah. Um, are you ever curious, what are the books I've read? So, curious ka lang ah. Sabi niyo na lang sa chat room, yes, kung hindi ah. Kung hindi, okay lang sa akin, I don't mind. What are the books I've read that have changed my life? What are the courses I took that have changed my life? Seminars that I've attended? And what are the mentoring programs I've attended that have made an impact sa aking uh, way of living? Okay. For those of you who don't know how I live, I actually work from home. I surf all day because that's what I do. That's what I love to do. Okay? If you love to play piano all day, that's what you're going to do. Ako, I surf the internet all day for fun. Okay? I do seminars twice a month, maybe. Mga lang. I'm not even in the seminar business at all. So that's what I do. If you like that kind of result, and I, and I actually make X number of times more than I made during my 18 years of employment. Since, wala pa akong stress ng boss. Okay? And I do this for fun. Bla. So if you want to get that kind of results, you probably want to know what were the success secrets that were the ingredients to that kind of success. And, yan. I can give you that in that bonus, the success secrets bonus. And if you avail before uh, the deadline, the deadline of the early bird, we're still on the early bird for the workshop, I'm going to give you another bonus that involves the Macintosh, the iPad, and the iPhone, okay? So, here's the bonus, okay? This is not for people who own this. This is for people who want to learn the skills to use this para maka-charge ka sa VA. Okay, if you avail before August 8, August 7 is the early bird, you learn how to use the Macintosh, the iPad, and the iPhone to increase your marketing skills and marketing if you know how to use these skills using those machines, your rate can increase to the point that you can buy your own devices even if you don't have. My rule is to teach you how to use it. At tingin ko, pag tinuro ko sa inyo, kahit hindi nyo pa nagagamit, marunong na kayo. And that's a bonus if you avail of the, of the workshop, the downloadable or the live one before August 8. Kasi August 7, which is a Tuesday, that's when we increase prices to additional 500. So... Let me just ask you for, if you want to avail of it now, let me tell you the price first. Because, uh, until August 7, it's 
Okay? The website before, sa ilalim niya yung price, nandyan yung, if you click that, you can use your credit card right now to order it using the internet. Use your mother's credit card, your brother's credit card, pangakuan mo sila, itapos saka niyo siya gawing installment kung gusto nyo, pero wala akong installment nito. The early bird is going to be enforced until August 7. It's going to increase by 500 pesos after August 7. <coughs> okay? So that's the early bird. You get the bonus, yung tatlong bonus na binigay ko sa inyo. Uh, two bon tatlong bonus plus yung bonus ng iPad, iPhone, at saka Mac. If you do this before this date. Teka lang ha. <coughs> Tapos kung pairs kayo, you coming to the event. You have to come to the event. Hindi pa din downloadable. May discount ka ng 2,000. Pairs have discounts of 1,000 each. So, you look for a pair. I don't know how. I, bahala kayo how to look for a pair. The, looking for a pair is obvious. Just open your eyes. You get to pay just 8750 Okay? But this this price is only valid hanggang Tuesday. Okay? So, kung dalawa kayong pupunta sa event, you have to pay sabay. Ayan yung website. Click that. You can pay using credit card. You can also pay using BPI, by the way. Same rate. And... Para nyo nang awa, huwag na i-convert yung dollar to peso, nag-iiba yan. So, kung ano yung dollar namin yun na yun. Okay. The downloadable, hindi applicable ang pairs dyan kasi mag-isa ka lang talaga pag nito-download ka. Here's the website for the downloadable. If you're not gonna be in Manila, okay, during that workshop. But you can attend the follow-up sessions also. So, that's the link to the downloadable. Okay. So, let me just reward the people who are actually people of action. Tanong, sino dito ang people of action? Same rate ang ano ah, ang live at download same rate. Sino ang people of action dito? Sige na, yes. Sabi nyo, yes, ako yan. Lang, tanongin lang, tanong lang. Are you a person of action? Actually, kung gusto nyo mag-succeed sa buhay, kailangan sabihin nyo, ako yan. Kahit nasa puso ninyo, hindi naman totoo yan eh, ang tamad-tamad ko nga eh. Okay lang yun, magsinungalay ka sa sarili mo. Sabihin mo, yes, I'm a person of action. Because you gotta. You understand what I'm saying? You gotta tell what you want to happen. You have to stop telling the truth that you are lazy because it's not helping you. Tama ba ako? Naintindihan niyo ba yun? Stop telling the truth that you are a lazy person. Tell what you want to happen. Sabihin mo, you are a person of action. E pag tinanong ko, yes. Sabihin mo, yes, I am that person of action. Yes, I am the person of action. Ganun talaga. I'm giving you the success secrets already. If you are still complaining, employee mind, it's okay, dating ang panahon, sasabihin mo sa sarili mo, ang common sense naman noon, but hindi ko pa naisip noon. Kaya nga, ang gawin mo, suspend na lang the judgment. Na hindi, hindi, doubts, doubts, doubts. Suspend that and say, since gusto mo na maging personal action ka, na hindi ka tulog sa mundo, sabi mo lang yes. Suspend your judgment. Sabi mo lang, yes, I am the person of action. Okay, if you are this person of action, let me test you. Okay, if you get into the workshop, you reserve your seat, you pay for it, okay, before today is over, which means you need to use your credit card or somebody else's credit card. Okay, I'm gonna give you uh, a letter from Ann Yamagishi. And who's Ann Yamagishi? I'm just gonna read it for you. I just wanna say thank you, Jomar, for the ideas that popped into up upon my purchasing of the online breakthrough seminar which resulted to the business I am venturing now. Ulitin natin, from An Yamagishi, Pilipino to. Ada Japan, <laughs> obvious. I just want to say thank you for the ideas that pop up upon my purchasing of the online breakthrough seminar which resulted to the business I am venturing now. Okay, what is the obvious question, people of action? What is the obvious question? Come on, come on, people of action. You have read this. Si An Yamagishi, Binili niya yung online breakthrough seminar ni Jomar. Meron na siyang businesses ngayon. Plural. Okay? What's the obvious question? How to pay cash? Hindi, hindi yan ang obvious question. Kaya niya yan. Sinabi ko na sa inyo. Kaya niya yan. Marketers, come on. Kaya niya yan. Okay, sige. Sasabihin ko na yung obvious question. Ano yung online break to seminar? <laughs> hindi ba? Hindi what's her business? Ang obvious question, naka-underline. Ano yung online break to seminar? 
The online breakthrough seminar is the seminar that Jomar conducts when people ask him, paano ba kumita sa internet? Ayan. Yung, kumbaga, ano yung overview, Jomar, in nine hours, or eight to nine hours, what, tama, what did she do? Yun ang obvious question, what did she do, di ba? <laughs> Where the first question, if you don't know the answer, is what is the online breakthrough seminar? It orients a person on how people earn from the internet. Okay? That's the online break to seminar. And for those of you who are men of action or women of action, I'm going to give you the downloadable version of the online break to seminar if you avail of the workshop before the day ends. So, huwag niyo nang isipin, ano ba yung online break to, online break to, break to seminar? Makukuha niyo siya ng libre. It's like, how many hours of seminar yan? Uh, eight hours, I think, or seven hours of seminar that teaches you all the techniques na ginagawa ng mga Pinoy pa paano kumita sa internet and what works and what doesn't work. Yan ang laman niyang online wealth break to seminar. It's a startup seminar to understand how to make money from the internet using different ideas. Kasi di ba, mayroong virtual assistant, di ba? Mayroon pang ibang ways para kumita sa internet, bilang VAs. Ang laman ng online wealth break to seminar are those other ways, in- including yung, bre- yung virtual assistant. So that's the bonus for the people who are people of action. If you act now, I'm going to give you the downloadable version of the Online Wealth Break to Seminar for free. This is like about $60, $67, to, okay? Para malaman nyo yung ginawa ni Anya Magishi. Tama ba, Anya Magishi? Okay. Para malaman mo ano yung information na nakuha niya, sa mga ideas na nakuha niya sa download Online Wealth Break to Seminar. And that's applicable for those who avail of the workshop downloadable or live before the day is over so this this is just for today okay so you can use your bpi you can use uh sorry hindi pala bpi kasi sa sunday ngayon ano you can only use your credit card online and the links if you want to become a marketer and you want to grow is there any one of these pick any one of these before the day ends i'm going to give you the online breakthrough seminar okay Plus the bonus of the Macintosh, iPad, iPhone lesson. Plus the success secrets. Plus the success wallpapers just for fun. Plus the e- uh, removing your computer clutter e-presentation. All of those. Plus the five days of learning. All of those for the rate that I asked. The, the 9750 was my 2008 rate. For those of you who don't know, uh, if you think that's high, it's not. Okay? It's not high. That used to be my 2008 rate for a two-day event. Okay? Right now, it's five days plus a, bu- a bunch of bonuses that you can actually use. Okay? So, so for those of you na interested talaga na gumamit ng BPI on a Sunday, send me an email. Okay? Send me an email. Yes. Ay, teka lang. Kaya ko bang, hindi, hindi niyo makikita yung screen ko eh. Okay, so, you have to send me an email. You know my email naman, di ba? If you're really, if you believe you're a person of action, you want to get that online wealth me- uh, breakthrough seminar for free. You avail today. Let me just tell you what my definition of today is para it's fair to all. Gusto niyo fair to all? Yes? Okay? Uh, no, you can't pay in summit. Jomar's definition of today is New York time. So, look at your calendar and look at your time. Kung anong oras sa New York and it's still, what is that day? What is the day today? It's still, what is the day? Uh, August 5 in New York City. Yan. Okay? If it's still August 5 in New York City, applicable pa rin yung bonus na online wealth break to seminar. Okay? So, tingnan nyo na lang kung ano yun. Actually, ang tip doon, hanggang tanghalian lang bukas ng Monday. Yun. Okay. Mag-deposit kayo bago mag-lunch tomorrow kung gusto nyo mag-BPI. Okay. I'm gonna try to look for the BPI things pero it's easier just email me kasi I'm talking. Okay. It's hard to type. Okay. So, I hope you guys learned something today. Uh, if you got questions, uh, I still have time for questions. Actually, wala na pala. Wala na pala akong questions. Hindi po pwedeng post-dated check unless ang post-dated mo is malapit na malapit na. Okay, as in a few days from now. Okay lang yun. Sige. 
not an installment, ang suggestion ko, gumamit kayong credit card, tapos pa-installment na sa credit card. Yun ang solusyon ko doon. Okay? Any more questions before I end today? Thank you. You can plug in those well, uh, those words sa browser niya para makapag-pay kayo by credit card. Any more, more questions? Upcoming seminar. Okay, meron akong seminar. Yeah. September 15 is my VA seminar. Pero matagal pa yon. September 15, VA seminar. Let me just help you by typing it up. Ito mga events ko, dami. Pero medyo, medyo madami. Pero anyway. So, September 15, VA seminar, pero tagal pa yan. If you want to go there, I suggest you download it na lang. Because you are people of action. May option siya to download. So, yan, yan. For those of you na gustong matuto ng Facebook naman, Facebook marketing skill, ano, expertise. Wala pang website. <laughs> September 29 yan. Okay? And on August 14, we got an interview with another VA. That's 8 p.m. again. That's also Tuesday. Para alam niyo yung coming up na events. So this is free. I will do another we uh, Pinterest event, uh, webinar. I don't have the date yet. Kasi mauna si ano. Mauna si... VA. Okay? Uh, online club members, no discount yet because you didn't have time to prepare for it. Sorry. Don't have a credit card. Doesn't matter if you don't have a credit card. If you're a person of action, may paraan. Right? So, use your mother, brother, sister. Kayan yan. If you really want it, you're gonna get it. It's re if you really want it lang talaga. Okay? So, there it is. Thank you so much for attending the webinar. I hope you learn a lot. Okay? 227 is the discounted price already. If you convert that, it's even less than 2750. That 9750. If you use today's rate, that's 294 uh, lang yan. Pero pag nag-iba ang rate ng peso dollar, syempre mag-iba na naman yan. Okay? So, come in right now while the rate of the dollar is low. 227 US dollars is the discounted price already. Convert nyo, subukan mo. Pero wag nyo ko convert kasi useless yan. Convert mo sa ibang araw, iba na naman ang rate. Okay? OMC to... Hindi pa eh. Hindi pa kayo pwedeng mag-avail ng discount sapagkat wala pa kaming set up para mag-avail ng discount. I gotta set it up for you guys pa. Okay? Online Mentoring Club members, wait lang for my go signal. If you're depositing, yes, you can deposit the discounted 1,000. For those of you who don't know, if you're an online mentoring club member, you do get a discount of 1,000 pesos. Basta na set up na ni Jomar yung discounts. If you're depositing, I don't have to set up anything. Go ahead and deposit the amount. Okay? If you're not going to be in the Philippines in September, you just attend, uh, you just download the, ano, the video of the event. Wala akong free VA seminar. Actually, don't do that. Kailangan may commitment yung tao eh. Yes, of course, you can refer your friends to the free webinars all the time. Yes, we do like to help uh, OFWs. You can, you can join the remaining ano, events by downloading the events if you are not able to attend yung... Tinutukoy ko ah, yung follow-up session, yung September-October. Okay, pag nag-avail ka ng downloadable, you get the recordings. Pag nag-avail ka ng live, you get the live of the workshop, but not the recording of the workshop. You understand me? You don't get everything, you know? Ang makakakuha lang ng everything ay, eh, you have to pay extra for the recordings if you attend live dun sa workshop. Pero may recording ka ng first webinar at saka ng dalawang follow-up events. Mayroon ka pang recording nun. Okay, so, but... I do give away the presentations and handouts during the live event. 
yun naman ang wala pag nag-download ka. So, if you're gonna ask me, go for the live events. Because life-changing ang live events. Okay? Pero kung hindi ka makapunta sa Pilipinas, your best really is the downloadable version. Okay? I only have... Okay. Can OFWs in London do VA jobs? Oh, syempre naman. Kahit saan. December... Minsan, may na akong ano, seminar sa December. Minsan na. But, depends sa demand. Welcome. To make sure, ano ha, make sure i-click mo yung tamang link, download VA Expert How. Yung How is Hands-On Workshop. That's the downloadable version. Just make sure you're clicking on the right link. Or you're typing on the right link. Gabriel. Okay, that's all that time we have. I'm extend. Actually, exacto na ako ng one ah one hour thirty minutes, which is typical webinar time. Thank you very much. If you have questions, just don't hesitate to email me back. You know my email. You know my Facebook. Ah, if you don't know, just go and here's my email. I'm gonna just send you. I'm gonna just send you my email para alam niyo lahat. Kasi bakak hindi niyo alam lahat. Email ko is. Yan, o di ba? Yan ang aking email. Kung hindi nyo alam, let me just type it. Hmm, ayan. Yan ang aking email. If you have any questions, so thank you very much for joining us. We I enjoyed helping you guys out. Um, congratulations for those na nag-expand ng mind, naging marketer. Live a marvelous life. May meaning yun. Tingnan nyo sa Bible kung yung sabihin ng marvelous. That's how you were created by God. You are marvelous. You should be living a marvelous life. And that's why we do this. That's why I do this. Para we don't live a suffering life. We live a life that we love to live. Okay? I'm off to another vacation. Para lang alam niyo, that's also part of my life. Maraming bakasyon. So, gonna be out of Manila again. Again? Kasi kagaling ko lang sa Tagaytay last week. Yeah? So, bakasyon na naman ako. Gusto niyo ng ganon? Vacation madalas? Just for fun? Act. Act quickly. Act while you're young. I'm giving you the chance. This is not gonna go on forever. One day I will disappear from this world and become a uh, spiritual being, you know? While I'm alive. While you're alive and able. Habang nakikinig kayo ngayon. Act now. Okay? Kumilos na kayo. Kasi si Mr. Doubt, matagal niyo nang pinakikinggan. At wala naman kayo masyado na pala sa kanya. Right? Uh, by the way, there is a money back guarantee. So, no problem. I'm not morbid. I'm very real. Mortality is very real. Right? Are you gonna live forever? This is the reason why we maximize time. Because we do not live forever. We maximize time because we know one day our children will be too too old for us to enjoy because we're too busy working kaya act now act now walang mawawala sa inyo sa money back guarantee so ano pang gusto nyo Mr. Doubt <laughs> so please do your best may gusto may paraan kung ayaw may dahilan yeah galing talaga ng Pilipina no? so good night goodbye uh, good night good morning and good evening Good day to all. Live a marvelous life. Bye.